Okay, since everybody's making these little videos on how to clean the catalytic converters, I just tried something a little, a little bit cool. So I uh, took my flashlight, stuck it in here. I don't know if we can see this or not. Not so good. Yep. I'm gonna try to. Probably can't see that. No. Nope. Anyway, I just got done cleaning it out and I can see through it now. It's a lot better, okay? But what I did, I got another video that showed this, but here's some wheel acid. All right, this has some interesting stuff in it. It has right there. Right, 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 right there, yeah. Contains some hydrofluoric, sulfuric, and phosphoric acid. Okay, good stuff. I mean, it really cooks it up good. And I kind of like that. So what I did is I cut this jug out, filled it up, stuck this in there for about 20 minutes or so, just like so. And then I got it out and I did a little dip wash. I did the, uh, the dip and drain drain. <laughs> Kind of like that, yeah, whatever. But anyway, and then after that, I got this cool little thing I rigged up. Okay, there it goes in here. You can check the pressure. Dial it here, like that. And this over here has water. Yeah, so it sprays water out here. Just like that. Pretty cool, huh? Now, when we add this two together, we get a nice little blaster. So, yeah, see that? So now, Add a little water. See, now we got a nice, got a nice little pressure washer going on there. Give it a hoser. Oh yeah. That cleans it up pretty good, Lord. Just do that for a while. I mean, it takes a long time to clean it, but. Gonna clean it out good, do both sides. Nasty. I did this for the other Cadillac converter too. So we're gonna see. We're gonna see how it turns out. I'm gonna shut this off. I'm just gonna do a nice little rinse. Have water coming out of there. Flush it the other way. This is fun. It's not fun taking it out, but it's still fun. Right? Right. Just like it. Could be worse. Could be working on a Nissan. Oh no, worse yet, you could be working on a Volvo. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, look at that. Would you look at it? Cool. Shut this off. Yeah. Now I'm gonna blow it out with air and take a look at it. Okay, this thing is pretty clean. Um, I just had the flashlight held in there where I could see in there. Now, see that? That bugger is pretty darn clean. I didn't get that a minute ago. It was pretty dirty. But you can see the light coming through there quite nicely. So I'd say it's clean. Now I'm going to make a part two to this video. Um, like I said, that was using that wheel acid, which is basically used for cleaning aluminum rims. Um, and I have it probably at about 80% uh, acid uh, content. I just diluted it a little bit, but I just filled that thing up right there. Like I said, I just filled this up, put a little water in it, not much, and 80%, and it just uh, it cleaned it pretty darn good. Clean this too. So that's my little experiment. I hope you liked it, and look for the part two of this video. Um, we'll do the diagnostics on it and see if the catalytic converters pass. If they pass, 
sweet. <laughs> it's a bonus, right? You don't have to spend three, four, five hundred dollars replacing these big old buggers. Okay, and this is actually on a Tourig, so they're really expensive.